Hi. We are going to study the B Locrian mode 7 open position or pattern number 1. The Locrian mode 7 is created by the C major scale. The C major scale is a very special scale. The Locrian mode 7 is the 7 degree of the C major scale. You can count C, D, E, F, G, A, B, the 7. The key of B, Locrian, is the only keys that has all natural notes or tones. The remaining 11 other keys we need to apply accidental to the step according to the Locrian mode 7 formula. Let's turn the note on. The Locrian mode 7 formula is a half, a whole, a whole, a half, a whole, a whole, and a whole. So half step is between the first and the second step half step also between the four and the fifth let it play <laughs> fretboard the root or the tonic note the B on fifth string second fret you walk up the step according to the Locrian mode 7 formula B to C is a half C to D is a whole D to E is a whole E to F is a half F to G is a whole G to A is a whole A to B is a whole From root to root, the open second string, the B, to the root on fifth string second fret, that one octave in red. The Locrian mode seven is the seven tone or seven notes. The black note, the C, the D on second string, the E, the F, the G on first string. They are belong to above octave or higher octave. The blues note, the A, open A, the open E, 6th string, the F, the G on 6th string. This note I belong to below octave. If you play all the notes on the right fretboard, you are playing 17 tones or 17 notes instead of 7 tones or seven note if you play from root to root. You see the solid red, the B O second string opens and the B on fifth string second fret. You play all the note, you play seventeen note three octave range. Display degree, display interval, display note. The left fretboard is a fingering fretboard. You see I use the middle finger to play the root on 5th string 2nd fret and I use an open B on 2nd string to play the root. I'm going to set the tempo up faster. Let it play forward, reverse, ascending, descending for a minute or so to train my ear on the B Locrian open position. <laughs> Set your metronome up at the tempo, not so fast, not too slow, so you can be able to play right on the beat. Use alternate picking. At first you had to pay attention on the left fretboard to follow the fingering pattern. Pay attention to the fingering that play the roots. 
start play the pattern with the open E on 6th string walk up the step and still you play the G on 1st string 3rd fret now go back in descending until you play the open E on 6th string you just make a complete pass now start over and try to do it 5 times without taking a break to train your finger play loud, play clean, play right on the beat. When you get better, set your tempo faster and do your drill over again. Do it every day, trying to stay 10 times without taking a break. This is how you train your finger to follow your command. Train them to walk straight, play clean, when you get really good at it, you may not have to look at the left fretboard to follow the fingering because you remember it as you practice every day. You start playing at any note, put your feeling, your mood into your playing, put hammer on, hammer up on the note, sustain it, bend the string, put your feeling to it trying to create a leak. If you keep trying, sooner or later you will come up with your own leak. I see you in next lesson.